Basta na mga kaadik, long time no upload <laughs> I decided to change my stock 500 watts hub motor with the 1500 watts hub motor to get extra speed This is the 1500 watts hub motor, I got this from Chenchen Bicycle Shop It's the same shop where I got my extra battery pack It's a generic or unbranded hub motor, 48 volts, 1500 watts Alright, let's jump to it First, I removed the deck cover these are the whole sensor wires and these are the motor face wires. Then I disconnected the wire connectors. I removed the connector of the stock hub motor whole sensor wires so that I could easily slide the wire off from the deck. Place the scooter on a high stable flat surface. It would be easy to remove the hub motor when off the ground. Next, I removed the brake caliper to get better access while performing the procedure. Then, I started removing the hub motor from the swing arm. Finally, done removing the stock hub motor. Next was, I unscrewed the disc brake rotor. Then, I removed the tire and the inner tube. After I removed, I proceeded installing the inner tube and the tire on the new hub motor. I inflated the tire using my mini air pump. I got this from Amazon. It's good to have one for an emergency. Then I installed the disc brake rotor. Make sure all the screws are tight. The hub motor was ready. Right away, I installed it in the swing arm of my electric scooter. I checked the alignment and tightened up the nuts. This is the cable wire of the new hub motor. These are the all sensor wires and these are the motor face wires. I used a thin metal rod from a metal hanger. I taped the wires and the thin metal rod together. Then I carefully slid through the deck all the way to the other side. These are the whole sensor wire extension to the controller. Then, I installed the connector on the whole sensor wires of the new hub motor. These are the motor face wire extension to the controller as well. Since I don't have a green wire, I used the color yellow and labeled it with color green tape. This indicates that this is for the green motor face wire. These are the blue and yellow extension wires. My controller is a 600 to 1000 watts unbranded one. Then, I connected the hub motor face wires and the whole sensor wires to the extensions. I carefully put the wires inside the deck and returned the deck cover. Remember that these three wires are the extensions connected to the hub motor face wires. And these three are the motor face wires from the controller. Blue to blue, green to green, yellow to yellow. These are the whole sensor wire extensions connected to the hub motor whole sensor wires. And these are the whole sensor wires from the controller. Red to red, black to black. These two wires are 5 volts lines, positive and negative. Be careful not to be reversed or mismatched to avoid damaging the components. Blue to blue, green to green, yellow to yellow. Finally, all the wires are set in place.
Mga idol oh. Andito sila oh. Popsi sa kasi Popsi bo, naabutan nila ako. 